Texas Tech's College of Education is very strong, uh, has a great reputation. I came here from uh, uh, halfway across the country and uh, I already knew about Texas Tech because of the reputation of the College of Education. Texas Tech is a number one institution, means it's at the top tier of uh, its research game. Um, that's important for anyone who does the kind of work that I do because it means that there are people who are thinking deeply and um, in a way that is supported by the institution about the problems that matter. The PhD in Educational Leadership Policy has a, a couple of things going for it. Um, one is it's online, which means that people can enroll in the program and be a part of the program from literally anywhere in the world. A PhD affords us the opportunity to think about what does the data say and how do we understand how the uh, data that we have available or that we can collect can help us make decisions and guide policies that will then change school for the better. People who graduate from our program can uh, typically go into one of four different areas. They can work in higher education, higher education uh, as a, an academic and a scholar, as well as a research scientist. They could work as part of an educational agency, either at the local, state, or national level, where policy is actually made and often um, uh, enacted. Um, they can work at research institutes, uh, usually doing some sort of uh, project-driven work that would inform policy making by collecting data and doing analyses of that data to find out what the real needs are and what's working and what isn't working. And then they can work for advocacy groups or nonprofit organizations that usually are focused on a particular issue or event. So it could be um, school finance, it could be charter schools, it could be school safety, it could be a, a host of things that that advocacy group might be uh, working towards. In our doctoral program, we have a special emphasis on how policy connects to practice. Um, there really is no school or education without thinking about the students and the communities that the students are in. Um, and really, as a former high school teacher, uh, I think that it's really important that everything we do at the policy level translates in some way to, to classroom level practice or school level practice or community level practice. I would love to talk to anyone who has an interest in our program.